If you can remember back when I tore the, all the raised beds out because they basically all rotted in about three or four years and I was just tired of messing with them. I, I know there's a lot of people that have great luck out of raised beds, but I didn't and I've been gardening for 30 years on and off. And so I made these raised beds. I started in 2015 and upgraded them again in 2018. And then I think it was 2020 or 21. I know I had cancer, it must have been, I think it was after the cancer. So I think it was 2021. I tore them out, tossed all the wood over the fence because I intended to shred it up in the chipper shredder. These are two by 12s, by the way. You can't hardly really tell it because after only three or four years, they were rotted down to nothing. And that's kind of the problem with non-pressure treated wood that has ground contact. And I know there's a lot of people that say, oh, you can use pressure treated lumber in your raised beds. They'll last a lot longer. And at the time that I built these raised beds, it was kind of an experiment for one. And for two, if I was gonna use pressure treated lumber, I might as well just buy my vegetables from the store and not know what's on them either. So <laughs> that's kind of how it worked out. Anyways, what I wanted to show you is kind of how I do this. I basically take an ax, I split these up, which is mostly fairly easy for the most part, unless you get into some fairly decent wood, like you can see the yellow, yellower ones down there. Some of these I literally just pulled apart with my hands. Then I set the chipper shredder up, which is working great after I clean the carburetor. That's kind of another reason why I'm doing this video. And now let me show you how this turns out. Make sure the chipper shredder's on. Choke about not quite halfway because it was just on a little bit ago. And that's the sound of my chipper shredder running out of gas. But you can see it will just literally eat up this lumber. Let me get some gas in it and we'll keep going.
trying to get everything like my life has just been so disorganized ever since I got cancer everything's getting behind but basically I've been trying to get some stuff cleaned up just a whole long list of things that need done like I normally keep all this mulched this entrance to the garden mulch which you can see I still got some cleanup to do over here and mulch it out but trying to get all this stuff done 